All right, let's check in now with the Ed Gillespie campaign. 13 News Now reporter Laura Geller is live in Chesapeake, where Gillespie stopped by this afternoon. Well, guys, a lively crowd in Chesapeake today as Hampton Roads Republicans try to rally the troops, so to speak. In his 20 minutes here, Ed Gillespie acknowledged the race for the governor's mansion is a tight one. If this crowd has anything to say about it, Ed Gillespie will be the next governor of the Commonwealth of Virginia. This stop in Chesapeake was one of five campaign rallies across the Commonwealth today and is only one in Hampton Roads. Gillespie specifically mentioned issues affecting the people who live here, like the port, military, and traffic congestion. He believes his policy proposals have his campaign gaining momentum. We've been gaining steam over the past couple weeks, and I think we're gaining a lot of steam right now. But in a year without presidential elections, we asked the Republican how he can turn enthusiasm into actual votes at the polls tomorrow. We've got a great plan and a great team of uh, volunteers, dedicated volunteers, the mighty, mighty G-Force. There's thousands of us all across the Commonwealth, and we're getting our friends, our neighbors, people we work with to make sure they go vote tomorrow so that we win this race. The mighty, mighty G-Force will be out in full force tomorrow. And at, from here tonight, uh, Gillespie went to Richmond. And then later tonight, he will be with the rest of the Republican ticket in Northern Virginia. We, of course, will be back with the campaign tomorrow night in Richmond as the election results are counted. For now, we're live in Chesapeake. I'm Laura Geller for 13 News Now.